Now we'll see if we can wind a coil here real quick guys. Just taking my coil wire out off the spool. Nothing serious. I'm going to leave that sort of behind my foot here so it doesn't roll away on me. I'm going to start out. I'm just going to give a quick wrap around here just so it doesn't go anywhere. Pulling it nice and tight. The first uh, wind or two I'll uh, do by hand here so we can get, uh, get it into place. And then we'll attach the drill and speed it up here. Uh, be sure to count your turns, like I said, uh, in, I think before, I, I'm doing mine about 80 turns per coil. As long as your coils are all about the same, uh, it should be alright. And, uh, there we got three turns on, and here we go, we'll go put a few more on. That's four, five, six, seven, eight, five. That's about 40 turns at full bit, and keep that coil nice and tight. And this helps to retain some of that nice form, so you have good looking coils when you go put them uh, into your castings. And, uh, everything turns out fine. There and I'm at 41 turns. Now to put another 40 turns on, and uh, then I'll show you how to wrap one up real quick. What do you do? Whoa, 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 whoa. That's 46. 47, 48. Okay, wind them up. Keep it nice and tight. Now, one of the things that uh, they showed in a couple of the other videos, uh, I think from WinGen, was to make yourself a nice little hook device like this to uh, slide through. We're about to try it here. And, uh get through to put some tape on and through it goes I've got some pre-cut tape this is also advisable pre-cut your tape tack it on and pull through gee that works just like a charm fold the one side over there we go then you can do the other side and of course you can probably pick your coil form apart right away too there we get that over Get the tool, stick the tool right through, grab your tape, pack the tape on, pull it through, fold it over nice and tight, keeping your coil tight, and there you go. Now you can take your coil apart uh, out of the form. It shouldn't take too long. And if you're only winding nine coils, it really doesn't take you a long time to do this. Um, yeah, especially if there's one or two of you doing it, uh, uh, two or three helps, and away you go. Um, other tips of the day, uh, when you're working with these coils, try to remember how many turns you put on. That's the uh, most important part. So now that we can pry this apart, get the T apart here a little bit. There we go, got the tee off, pull my coil out, put my tape tabs on the rest of the way, and uh, one pretty decent looking coil, what do you figure? There we go, 80 turns, number 18 wire, and uh, we're all happy, we'll snip her off and uh, ready for the next coil. Have a great day guys, thanks for watching.